Okay. Well, here we are. Here's a new set of blank jaws for the 10 inch chuck for doing uh, piston, uh, for doing diesel pistol. And everybody asked me, how do you machine the inside and the back? Well, basically I bolt them to a 10 inch chuck, got a six inch ring that holds them in p position so you have the right radius for the bottom of the oil ring. But basically is all I do is bolt them into that chuck. <clears throat> And I got a tool bit set up for doing the ID at the bottom of the thing. Well, I run that through, I do that first. Then I've got another tool. And everybody always wants to know, how do I do the inside of the jaws? Well, see how I've got that j j tool bit? I cut it off and weld it to another tool bit and it's bolted in. But I'll show you here, we're gonna run these. It looks frightening, but it isn't. I, I machine almost all of the chucks. John, too old to know any better. Notice how we got a nice radius in here, but it's a big radius, so don't mark the inside of the piston. Now I take and I set it the other direction. Take one of my welded together tool bits. There's one over here too. But you can see that's welded together. Cut the back side and I cut the top down to size. What am I doing here wrong? Yeah, that was set up for too skinny of one. I need my other one. <laughs> that won't do that thick of a job. That one set down farther. That's just mainly a cleanup cut so it's square with everything. And I go in far enough for the depth of the ring. And then I end up taking about seven, eight, ten thousand on a back cut. And that's what gives the beautiful finish on the back. Now you know as much as I do about making jaws. But if you look in here on the back side, of a beautiful cut you have. Well, that's that back cut, what does that nice cut. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But now I don't know what width rings we're gonna be using, but now I change over. I set a tool bit up for the face. And then basically whatever you want it to be, 3 sixteenths, I, I do my width on the top. But I don't know what these are going to be yet, so I'm leaving them blank. Anyway, give us a holler. We make jaws for doing sleeves, make it for 6 inch, 8 inch chucks, and 10 inch chucks. And special ones for holding the bore of rods. <clears throat> but give us a call. We got the best. Talk to you later.